Counter development this hour. The CIA has determined that the Saudi crown prince ordered journalist Jamal Khashoggi's assassination, a journalist who resided in Washington, D.C. According to the Washington Post, the CIA examined multiple sources of intelligence, which included this, a phone call that the crown prince's brother, who is the Saudi ambassador to the United States, had with Khashoggi. Out front now, Shane Harris, one of the reporters who broke the story for The Washington Post. Shane, obviously, this is a huge development. This is not what the president wants to hear tonight. So, so tell me uh, what their, the CIA is, what has convinced them of the fact that uh, MBS ordered personally this assassination? Well, it's, it's kind of a mosaic of intelligence, actually. There's the phone call that you mentioned, uh, which is quite important with the ambassador talking to uh, 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 Jamal Khashoggi before he disappeared. Also, there is a phone call from inside the consulate, we understand from our sources, from one of the individuals that was part of this hit team calling back to uh, Saudi Arabia to confirm to a senior aide to Mohammed bin Salman that the assassination had taken place. There's also an audio from a listening device inside the consulate that the Turks had placed, and that audio was given to the CIA. Uh, there's other forms of intelligence we probably don't even know about. But also a big part of this is the CIA's assessment uh, since well before uh, Jamal Khashoggi was killed uh, that nothing really happens in the kingdom of Saudi Arabia without Mohammed bin Salman, the crown prince's say so. Mm -hmm. And they find it impossible to believe that an operation of this magnitude could have occurred uh, without MBS, as he's known, uh, authorizing it. And so that is also factoring into their conclusion that he was uh, the person who ordered this assassination.